Did you know that you can elevate your core strength by using neuroscience principles? Hello, Albamigos, I'm Celeste. I'm a yoga teacher, physiotherapist, and neuroscience student. And in this video, I'm gonna be sharing you how you can elevate the strength of your core but by using neuroscience. So we're gonna be looking at two different brain regions, the first of which is called your vestibular system or your middle ear. It gives you much of your balance. And the second is called the cerebellum. It actually works very closely with the vestibular system to give you control of your midline, specifically in relation to gravity. So let's have a look at three different tips to get your core working without you needing to think about it. The first one is unilateral weight training. So this seems super duper simple, but let me tell you that when a weight is pulling you to one side, your brain has to activate just the right muscles at just the right amount to make sure that your core is automatically on so that you don't fall to the side, but rather that you stay upright. So make sure that you grab a weight that's safe but challenging, and then train with it on just one side in a variety of different movement patterns. The second tip is perturbation. And in simple terms, this is when someone's gently trying to push you over. But you can also mimic the same action by climbing inside a stretchy band and then trying to do some of your regular training with the training band pulling you to one side. And the third and final tip is we tend to always train with our head stacked over our shoulders and very still but actually the head requires different movements when you're in nature, right? And this is what lights up different parts of the vestibular system. So mimic this in the gym by actually getting your head to do different shapes whilst you're doing your workout. You can do regular movements like your squats and your lunges, all with your head slightly at one tilt or in motion, which is gonna spice up your core. Of course, if you're up for the spicy challenge, you can combine all of these, but it's a big challenge, so take it easy and just do your best. Now, if you're like, ooh, these tips are so interesting and you wanna learn more, then of course, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let us know down below what you think of these. And of course, we can't wait to see you on the next video, so make sure you check out this one, which is also gonna give your core a little bit more fire.